It's VJ Brand here with Flex Sport. We're joined by Adam Azim ahead of his big fight this weekend at the Manchester Arena on the Calm versus Brook undercard. Adam, how are you feeling ahead of the fight this weekend? Yeah, I feel really good, very confident, and just can't wait to shine on uh, Saturday night. And what can the fans expect from you on Saturday? How is the fight going to go? How are you, obviously, I'm presuming you feel like you're going to win. How are you going to win? And what can we expect? Um, hopefully, I'll get that knockout. That's, that's my main thing. Uh, I want to be an explosive knockout. I want to showcase my skill as much as I can and hopefully um, just entertain uh, a lot of people there. So for those those people who don't know some of the fans that don't know you're on the card with your, your brother, how's that feel, both being in, in such a big stage together, going through this journey together? Obviously, sometimes people say boxing can be a very, very lonely sport, which it is, but you've got that added support there. You're both in it together. What difference does that play for you? How does it feel and what's it like having your brother by your side? It's amazing to have my brother there because he's always telling me, like, you know, I mean, the bad stuff, the good stuff, and he's always motivating me as well. And, and, yeah, and every time, you know, when, when we, like, training I've always given that encouragement as well so but having my brother there is just amazing Sky Sports we've just listened to the press conference there and Sky Sports have said a lot of big things about yourself and your brother which is amazing they seem like they're going to push you what is your goal obviously you've got this big backing now what is your goal for your career where do you want to go where do you see yourself maybe 12 months in the next couple of years uh, yeah, just this year I want to get as many fights as I can this year hopefully end of the year I want to get like a small title shot uh, something small but uh, in a couple of years time I want to be uh, the youngest world champion so. the sky's the limit the sky's the limit ok so we'll, we'll change our talk a little bit towards the main event Amir Khan versus Kel Brook long awaited um, we've been, I've been asking everybody for their predictions today Adam how do you see this fight going uh, I believe Amir Khan wins by knockout 100% he's just too fast too, uh, too powerful and he's in great amazing shape and I believe Kel Brook uh, hasn't got a chance do you think this fight's happened a little bit too late? Do, do you think it should have happened earlier? Do you think that's going to play a factor? The fans that are watching this fight now, are they still going to see the same fight that we would have seen, say, five years ago, seven years ago? Uh, do you know what? Um, it, it, could have, it should have happened earlier, but it, it, the fight's happened now. So any, if they were even older, they're, they're still, everyone would still entertain and watch it. So I believe like uh, any age, Armour Khan would have beat Kelbrook easy. It's a little bit strange because um, a lot of people saying they are too old, it's past its time, but there's a lot of people at the same ages as Amir Khan and Kelbrook, world champions who are in the prime, so I think it's, it's going to be a good fight on Saturday. Um, how have you been feeling in the preparations for this fight? How's your fight week been going, so on and so forth? Yeah, it's been great. This is probably one of my best camps I've ever had. I've been sparring every single week and I'm looking sharp, looking powerful and just can't wait to show everyone on Saturday night. Adam, thank you very much for your time. Good luck on Saturday. Thank you very much.